I got you, sis. Let's make some molds. Amazing casting resin, the one that cures in 10 minutes. It comes in two parts. You simply mix the two parts together. You need to work quickly because it cures really fast. This is a mold. I sell these on my website. You want to pour the mixture into the mold quickly but carefully. It cures really fast, so you have to work quickly. Do small batches at a time, like one mold at a time. You can use a little stick to kind of move the resin around and fill up your mold. Then you want to let it dry for about 10 minutes. You see how it turned white? Bend your mold and the edges will kind of pop up a little, and that's when you know it's done. If you're fighting your mold and the edges aren't popping up, it's not done. Give it a couple more minutes. You can clean up your molding with some scissors. So these are resin moldings. You can make them ahead of time. They will last forever. Now let's make some clay moldings. I'm using small molds and creative paper clay. You want to dust your molds with a little bit of household cornstarch so the clay doesn't stick. Pinch off a piece of the paper clay and just push it into the mold. You can add a little bit more if you need to. Or use your thumbs to remove the excess if it's too bulky. And repeat. You can take these out of the mold right away and pinch off the excess and kind of clean them up with your fingers a little. You do need to use these immediately or they'll shrink and crack. Or you can freeze them in a Ziploc baggie and use them later. It's time to glue! Using Tight Bond Quick and Thick Glue. Our resin moldings are hard and we want to soften them up a little so they'll conform to our project. I'm using a heat gun, but you could use a hair dryer. Now we can add our glue very generously Brush it around, make sure you fill up the whole backside and get the edges. Those yellow dots are where my new knobs are gonna go, so you don't make that mistake twice. Just press it on, hold it for a few seconds, and that's it. Repeat, repeat. Now let's add a little dimension with our paper clay moldings. Same process, just put the glue on, brush it around, but these guys are soft and squishy. So you want to gently tap them in there so you don't push the design right out of them. But look at that great dimension. It's amazing. After about 24 hours when it's all dry, that's when we paint. If you're in the U.S., you can get these products at heartlandvintagemarket.com.